Hello Aquarius. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Before I get into your weekly read, I just want to let you know, um, instead of doing the bonus reads tomorrow's the top three viewed highest signs, I'm going to do air, earth, water, fire tomorrow. So there will be a bonus read for you air signs. So look out for that. And hopefully it'll, hopefully it'll be out before 9am central standard time, maybe even earlier. Alrighty Aquarius. I have Tarot the mystical moments for the main deck. I have dreamscape tarot for the clarifying deck and the links to these decks can be found down below in the description box i got the justice libra and energy coming in at the bottom of the deck and i have the ace of pentacles reverse so let's see what's below the justice got you look at that queen and king of swords six of swords reverse and the magician energy revving up revving up revving up high priestess and the fool is just going and justice is a new contract could be a soul contract soul mate coming in a job it could even be the courts um having an answer here all right what's going on here aquarius sun moon rise in venus aquarius if you are an aquarius no an aquarius feel like being an aquarius aquarians i'm glad you're here you could be an aquarius and this resonates you could be dealing with an aquarius it could resonate as the main story and aquarius can be the cross watcher this reading could be about an aquarius or for an aquarius take it as it resonates collect the messages from my lovely aquarians sun moon rising venus what is the energy coming towards aquarius they need to be aware of what is the energy coming towards aquarius what is the energy coming towards aquarius what is the energy coming towards Aquarius they need to be aware of? What is the energy coming towards Aquarius? Okay, we got Magician Reverse, Ten of Cups Upright, and the Hierophant Reverse. Ooh, what is going on? Is this a third party? Knight of Cups and a King of Cups Reverse. I get with somebody, I get worry. Why do I get worry, worry, worry? King of Cups reverse, possibly. Ace of Swords reverse. Seven of Wands. Worried about how somebody feels. So a Magician reverse is feeling powerless in a certain situation. Ten of Cups is, I feel like somebody knows this is who they want. Ten of Cups is happily ever after. Amen. And you got the Hierophant reverse. It's just like maybe something's not coming together. You really want it to come together. The Knight of Cups is here. But... King of Cups reverse, Ace of Swords reverse, and the Seven of Wands. You know what I'm also feeling here with the Seven of Wands? It could be a little bit of flirtation and flirty, but Ace of, but there's a lack of speaking on it. There's a lack of proper communication of how somebody feels. And here you're coming to Tarot to figure it out. What's influencing the Magician reverse? Ten of Cups and the Hierophant reverse. What's influencing the Magician reverse, Ten of Cups and the Hierophant reverse? Yeah, Page of Pentacles. I feel like somebody, I feel like you want somebody to say, Aquarius, this is it. This is what I want. An offer. Reason for the reading. Reason for the reading, Aquarius. Six of Swords reverse. Unable to move forward. And I feel like, honestly, it just feels like being stuck on somebody. And it feels new and it feels cute. And it feels like something went from um, just a crush to developing actually feelings here. And you're worried it might be just non-reciprocal. What's in the past? What's in the past? What's in the past? Six of Pentacles. There it is. It's not in your head. I feel like I need to say that. If you worry that you made this all up and you're seeing something that is not really true... You got a six of pentacles, equal reciprocity, equal reciprocity back here. Something real, something offered energetically of some sort. What is on your mind? What is on Aquarian's mind? There it is. Queen of Swords looking at a distance really i guess it could be watching at a distance to see you know how she's still tethered to where she is kind of like the world but the world is it's like you're in that beginning but not fully in it and see the birds and the freedom it just feels like there's something you want maybe at a distance again energetic distance physical distance seeing if it's coming towards you that's the feeling i get it is it coming towards me what else is on aquarius's mind 
I have to say, I have to laugh at the Libra and energy because I did Libra first and that sounded really naughty, but, um, and you, there was more Aquarius in that. That's why I did your reading next. And here's Libra. What is on, what, I was almost said it. What's on Aquarian's mind? What is on Aquarian's mind? Two of Pentacles reverse. It's like something's taking longer. You thought you're on the same page here, but somebody pulled themselves back. Ten of Cups says, hey, there's still emotions here, but there's like nothing coming together. What the hell? What's in the near future? What's in the near future, Libra? They get cold feet. What's in the near future? I really get on your mind, though, seeing what's going on. Two of Pentacles, it just feels like when it's like this, it's like the fool, the world, the star, all the majors are presented. It's, it's just taking a chance and happy. When it's like this, somebody's resisting taking that chance. And I feel like with the Queen of Swords, it's trying to figure out why. What's going on? What's taking so long? What is in the near future for Aquarius? Did I say Libra? I'm sorry. I'm, some of you have to be dealing with a Libra or something. What's in the near future for Aquarius? Four of Swords, Libra. What? The, there's a lot of cards in here. There's a lot of Libra energy coming out. That's wild. We saw the Justice. Um, oh, look at the strength in the Seven of Pentacles. Two of Cups, King of Swords. There you are. Two of Swords reverse, making a decision. I do feel like somebody's going to choose you, but why did they get cold feet? Hierophant reverse and a, and a magician reverse. Are you still in something, Aquarius? Are they just out of something or in something? Or do they need to make a decision? I just feel, honestly, I really do feel, Aquarius, that you're waiting on somebody to like make this official. Like they said so back here. But four swords is peacefulness. It's happiness. And then the bottom of the deck is really thinking about what to do, what to do. And the strength card, two of cups. I feel like it's this, okay? Now twos and tarot talk about duality and need to make a decision. This is with you. This is how somebody feels. Two of cups, king of swords. In love. I just feel like somebody's totally head over heels. But then over here, seven of pentacles is about reflecting about where you are. And it's the should I stay or should I go card. Somebody's still holding on to what they've been in. And then there's this four of swords here. So let's see what's going on. Why the four swords? Give me one more card in the near future. I'm not clarifying quite yet. Give me one more card in the near future for Aquarius. Give me one more card in the near future for Aquarius. Devil. Somebody's holding on like it's their last lifeline. And I do feel like somebody's holding on to you. And I do feel like you know that. But there is a lot of proper moving forward, and it's frustrating me. What's this magician reverse center of the reading? Gemini and Virgo energy. What's this magician reverse? Somebody feels like they can't do this. That's the magician reverse. I have no control. I have no choice. I'm, I'm stuck. You guys stuck here. What's the magician reverse? Yeah, three of wands reverse. It's like waiting for that soulmate to come in waiting for a ship to come in darn here's the ship reverse ship is in and now all of a sudden i feel like maybe somebody kind of went awol here they may have turned their back they're not really speaking you have to go play detective work what is this hierophant reverse what's the hierophant reverse here for leave i'm sorry aquarius jeez oh pete's What's the Hierophant reverse for Aquarius? Nine of Pentacles reverse. Nine of Pentacles reverse is the Empress reverse, the Minor Arcana card. But it's just feeling really down. It's really wanting something that's not coming together because somebody doesn't. And it, no, their eyes are open. They're totally woken up to what this connection is. They're just afraid. They're just afraid. They're afraid of losing you. They're afraid of having to say something. They're afraid of actually, it's so funny because when I did Libra's reading, that's what it was about, having something good, but they were afraid to speak on something. So it's just interesting that this is a bit of an extended reading here, but it's they're just afraid. 
but I feel like they're going to get over their fear for the desire of this. And I, I feel like Aquarius, you're going to get tired of waiting. I'll be honest. Ten of cups, you don't even need a clarifier. Somebody, I, I feel like you make somebody really, really happy and they see you as the end game. Ten of cups has their rainbow, right? The rainbow signifies that this connection has gone through its period of ups and downs and two people finally find their way together. But present, Six of Swords, reverse, we're still in that storm cloud. You want to get out of that storm cloud, but reverse, you're still quite in it. And I feel like you're going to like change, turn tables and say, hey, buddy or buddette, you be in the storm cloud and I'm going to be over here actively waiting, but moving forward. And when you figure your S-H-I-T out, come and see me down the road if I'm still available. Six of Swords, reverse reason for the reading. Your energy, what's the Six of Swords reverse? And this, look at two sixes. It's something so good, but so wasted. I feel like this person's wasting a good soulmate connection. And it's so frustrating. It's a frustrating for me right now. Six of Pentacles, six, 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 devil. I'm just saying, I'm, I'm just being a connector of dots today, but you guys make of it, <laughs> of you, I can't even speak. I'm tongue tied. I've never seen that before. Six of Pentacles in the past. I feel like somebody is holding on to you hard. They don't want you to get away from them, but they don't want to make a decision either. Six of Pentacles in the past. Page of Cups. Yep. It's not in your head. They have strong feelings. They just have a lack of forward movement. Queen of Swords, but a Two of Pentacles reverse. Libra and Capricorn. Queen of Swords and the Two of Pentacles reverse on your mind. Yep, Seven of Cups reverse. Trying to get the clarity. Trying to understand. Trying to separate fact from fiction. Uh, murkiness to clarity, right? And it's interesting because in the Seven of Cups, in the Seven of Cups, all the cups are beautiful and red. There's no like jack-in-the-boxes here. Like a lot of Seven of Cups depictions, sometimes it's the death card or snakes um, some cups have gold, some, you know, but all of these cups are full of love and red. I feel like that's what you're going to find out is I feel like this person only has eyes for you. They only want you. I just feel like they're just afraid, afraid of telling somebody else that they want you. Four swords and the devil in the near future. You're probably going to pull yourself back. Why the four swords in the near future? Five of swords reverse because you need a break from this, you know, rightly so. And it's interesting because at the bottom of this deck, it was an ace of pentacles reverse, right? You got an ace of swords reverse right here because there's lack of real communication. You're going to pull yourself back. But guess what this devil is? It's that other energy. Tell me about this devil, Capricorn and Capricorn, two of pentacles reverse. You got the devil here. What's the devil near future? Capricorn energy. What's the devil in the near future? King of Pentacles. Queen and King of Pentacles here. Because the devil's Capricorn. Give me one more card. King of Pentacles and the devil. And there it is. Ace of Pentacles. They're going to offer it. Newsflash. Surprise. They're going to finally offer it. But you have to some, be a, like... Why do they have to make it so difficult? Why does this person have to make this connection so difficult? They know they want it. They know they want it. They're awakened to it. And it, you have to like really pull yourself back and say enough's enough. And then here they are. I, I feel like they, the desire has to be stronger for, than fear for this person. And that's exactly what happened. They had fear here, but the desire for you overrode that fear. And here they come. Da -dum, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. This person isn't letting you go. They're holding on to you. They're holding on to what this can be still. So good luck. All right, Aquarius. I love you guys. Have a great rest of your weekend. I'll see you tomorrow for that bonus read. Take care.